Hello guys, welcome back to Ventilate. And here we are guys, I thought I'd show you a bit of the start of where I am. Rather than starting from zero, that I would start from something in the middle. Um, not really in the middle, still quite very much at the beginning of the um, actual run of this. But hey, I'll show you a little bit of my skill tree, okay? So there you go. You can pause if you want and you'll be able to see all of these things. And if you want to mimic it, go for it. And then you try and try and there you go. Anyways, so guys, I'm um, gonna use the pet build instead of uh, Shadow Clone. You can use either one of them. They're gonna be all good uh, to go because both of them are pretty strong. Uh, however, I just do want to click a little bit. I, I don't want to just sit there and not click. Um, I feel like it kind of defeats the whole points of Tap Titans too. So anyhow, um, there you go guys. Just gotta keep farming, just get higher, and then you should be able to hit your level 10. And don't worry about people that are already uh, high up to the point where they're already at level 10. And look at that, these guys are already at level 10. Uh, if you don't know how to get there, you can look up Orca. Orca is the way that everyone is doing it. Um, if you don't know it, you can jump into Reddit. And under Reddit, tap Titans 2, you're gonna be able to see Orca. And if you click into Orca, it'll show you how to get your build going. And it kind of explains how things actually work. Okay, let me get rid of these bad boys while I'm at it. Splash, one by three, why not? Jackpot, boom. Gunblade, I can't be asked doing the, um, uh, what do you call it? The actual run things where you have to get like all the different um, warrior, mage, and range and stuff. I was like, nah, 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 I'm not doing that. Uh, it's gonna take too much time for this. So this is where I'm ending up at. Wait, 102, yep, that's fine, 102. And guys, don't be worried about getting rid of your uh, legendary items because at the end of the day, if you're doubling the amount of damage, just use it because you're gonna, um, you know, you don't really have to worry too much about it because you will get better equipments uh, as this goes really, really quickly, right? So don't be afraid to sell your legendary or mythic uh, mythical items because that just makes you get to the next level a whole lot faster, which gets you 2,000 shots and then you'll be able to use it for the next round, okay? Let me just push until I can't push. And then I'll show you what happens and how I do my normal runs in the middle of the game. So at least that will make a bit more sense for you. All right. This may actually take a bit longer than I expected. I just hate how, how slow some of these things are um, at the bottom. As you can tell, I haven't got the uh, relic that unlocks the uh, spell refresh faster. So hence that's why here I am. Oh, another 90. Very nice, I like it. And nothing. Yep, there you go. Splash. Combate. Critical hit. Boom. Next. Another 320. Wow, look at that. How amazing is that? It just keeps going. I love it. I absolutely love it. And I think the next thing I'm going to get with my um, actual skill build or skill tree. I will be using um, contracts because contracts are very, very powerful. But once I fix my mana issue, my contracts are gonna be absolutely stunning. Um, they just give you a whole lot more of boosting and towards the end of it, you're gonna see it being very, very crucial. So don't forget about contracts. Contracts are amazing. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll show you real quick. Contracts are you, forbidden contract and the royal contract. This one gives you gold, this one gives you damage, and it is very, very OP. So make sure you do get that because it will change the game for you later on uh, as you get to higher stages. And one of the most important things when it comes to these games is to remember to have the mana boost as your secondary bonus under your uh, what do you call it? legendary aura. So in your aura area, you wanna have that because that will help you recover your mana a whole lot better than any items that you have out there. All right, so you just keep that in mind as you're playing it because you're gonna have to use it um, when it comes to the latest stages of your game. Okay, and then look at that. The fairies will replace it for me, and I'm still going. I can't believe I'm still going, guys. Look at that. Don't even have to prestige. How amazing is that, eh? Just keep going. Um, and I, some of my actual spells are not even running yet, and it's just still going. And just keep going. All right. I'm getting close. Can feel it slowing down soon. 
all right you know what guys look i may not be at the maximum but i think in order for me to show you where i am i will start to prestige over here real soon Ooh, that was pretty quick Did you see that guys a little quick hundred level jump right there i like it i like it seems a lot of fun and once i hit fourteen thousand. Be able to hit 14,500. Oh, look at that. And at 100, so I'm gonna get these bad boys. See anything else? Two, six, splash. Nothing crazy on a splash. Boom. All right, guys, just for the sake of the video, I am going to show you what happens instead of me just keep pushing. I'll be doing that after. So, guys, what you have to do is hit that bad boy when you prestige. You want to get these bad boys going, okay? So don't waste any time, just start hitting them. Uh, I gotta get that bad boy going, okay? And yes, yeah, so leave that in the background. As you do so, discover as much as you can, all right? Once you discover what you have to, make sure you get the right thing set up for you. Mm, oh, there you go, I gotta get that. There you go. And all, all of these little bad boys can just go in together. Clash of Warcraft, blah, 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 blah. Helmet, Mystic, Flying, Gold. Oh, that's going to be helpful. No need for Dagger. Is that for now? Okay, no. Legendary Pets. Exotic Pets. Okay, bang, bang. And it's going to reset it for you. And what you want to do is max out your Book of Shadows, okay? Hit it back at 25. Hit this bad boy. And once you hit that, just double check and see if anything is useful for you. Sell all these things, go back in. First thing I'm just gonna get is Treasure Hunter. So this is gonna give me better drops for later on. Nah, let's fuck it. Yeah, I mean, screw it. And we get that out of the way, and there we go. Get this here, bang, bang, bang. Just reset this. And what you don't need to do now is 25 and five everything out okay as you five everything out you're going to see the ability of look at that guys it's absolutely pouring it in right absolutely pouring it in and just start getting these runs to go And yeah, so that's how you do it. So as you do this, you're gonna be able to see your stats jump a lot higher and a lot faster. So this is how it happens during the mid AT. So next week, when it comes to the next AT, I will definitely do a late game AT, uh, where I'll start from about the level nine, uh, what do you call it, the level nine reward to the level 10 reward, just to show you how far it is. And even you're doing exactly what I'm telling you to do here, it will still take you a bit of time to get to that level because it is just so hard towards the end where you just have to prestige quite a few times in order for you to get into kind of advantage it just slows down dramatically Alrighty, guys well hopefully guys this is a little bit of a helpful um sort of view on how it actually happens and guys drop a like drop a subscribe that will help my channel a lot and helps me to continue to keep pushing out more content but any of any questions you got anything you want to say or uh, if you got a better idea definitely drop a little uh, comment at the bottom and I'll definitely get back to you. Alrighty guys, hope you have a very good weekend coming up and I'll catch you all later. Bye bye